this video, we're going to uh, see the, the solution of a, a small uh, trigonometry problem. Uh, so the question is the following. Knowing that uh, tangent uh, theta is uh, equal to one third, and that pi is that theta is uh, between pi and uh, three pi divided by two, uh, we need to find sinus uh, pi divided by three minus theta. Okay, so the way I did it was to start by uh, sinus pi divided by three minus theta over here. Um, and I developed that uh, using uh, using uh, the, um, the subtraction formula. So I said this was equal to sinus pi divided by three uh, times cosinus theta uh, minus cosinus uh, pi divided by three times sinus theta. So since we know sinus pi divided by three and cosinus pi divided by three, uh, uh, we have a second step. And now uh, we have uh, two, two uh, unknowns, the one which is cosinus theta and one which is sinus theta. So the idea was to put uh, tangent uh, cosinus theta in factor. And uh, by putting cosinus theta in factor, uh, in the first term, we don't have cosinus theta anymore, of course. And in the second term, we have sinus theta divided by uh, cosinus theta. So that ha that's actually that's uh, tangent theta. So that's why uh, we have uh, uh, 1 divided by 2 multiplied by, uh, multiplied by 1 divided by 3. Uh, one divided by three here is the uh, is the tangent theta. So basically, here uh, at the fourth step, we have sinus pi divided by three minus theta, which is equal to cosinus cosinus theta times something. So to go on, uh, we need to find to express cosinus theta. Now uh, that's possible. We can express cosinus theta knowing tangent theta. We just have to uh, to uh, play around with the formulas. So this is what I did on the right on the left. Uh, we have sinus theta squared plus cosinus theta squared equals one, which is the basic uh, trigonometrical um, formula that you need to know. And so cosinus theta squared is equal to tangent theta squared divided by one plus tangent theta squared. Now that's pretty that's pretty good. Uh, we just need to take in consideration that pi is uh, theta is uh, comprised between pi and three times pi divided by two. Um, so because of that, we know that uh, it's in the um, lower left quadrant of the trigonometrical uh, circle, which means that cosinus theta is negative. So when we take the square root of this expression, we have to, uh, to put a minus before it. So we have cosinus theta, which is equal to minus tangent theta divided by square root of one plus tangent uh, theta squared. So now we just have to plug in with what we know that tangent theta is equal to one third and we get cosinus theta is equal to uh, one divided by uh, the square root of 10. And uh, well, we're almost there, right? Because uh, then we just have to replace uh, cosinus theta on the right by one divided by a square root of 10. And then we have the result sinus pi divided by three minus theta is equal to uh, three square root of three minus one divided by six square root of 10. So here you go.